Hi, this is Karthik. I welcome you all for this session. In this session, I am going to teach you about PowerPoint 2010 views. Topic is overview of PowerPoint 2010 views. Let me see what is an view. The view in Microsoft PowerPoint 2010 that you can use to edit, print and deliver your presentations or as follows normal view slide sorter view note page view slideshow view which includes presenter view reading view and master view in master view we are having slides and sort and notes so what is a view here microsoft provides different types of view just like normal or slide sorter note page and blah 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 so based upon our requirements we can able to use this views so as the screen capture below shows you you can find the powerpoint views in two places so in this screen you can able to find out views in two places one is in view tab here you can able to see views and other is below the bottom of the window here you can able to see views again I repeat so here in view tab you can able to see views presentation views and master views and one more area where below the bottom where you can able to see there is a normal view this is a slide sorter view and there is a reading view and this is a slideshow view these are the two places where we can able to find slide views So as I said in view tab where you can able to see normal slide sorter, notes page, reading view, slide master, hand sort, master, note master and, and below the bottom of the window where you can able to see this, this is a normal slide sorter. So where this is a normal so slide sorter, so reading view and slide show view. So these are the two places where we can able to find views. Now we are going to see one by one. So on the view tab in the presentation view and master view groups. So on view tab we can able to see presentation views and master view groups. So in view tab where we can able to see so presentation views and master views. On easy to use bar at the bottom of the PowerPoint window where the main views that is normal slide sorter reading and slideshow are available. As I said, in the bottom is a normal slide sorter and reading view and slideshow view are available. So it is very easy to use because just just like in shortcut where you can easily apply the types of views. And views for editing your presentation. There are many views in a PowerPoint that can help you to create a professional presentation. So first one we are going to see normal view. In normal view is the main editing view where you write and design your presentation. Normal view has four working areas. So normal view is nothing but whenever we go for main editing normally we use. So this is called as normal view. It's a normal edit view where you can write and design your presentation. So normal views has four working areas. Now we will see one by one. So outline tab. So here you can able to see this in outline tab. This is a great place to start writing your content to capture your ideas, plan how you want to present them, and move slides and text around. The outline tab shows your slide text in outline form. So in case of outline tab, here you can able to see two tabs are available: slide and outline. We click outline where we can able to see only the text so it is very easy for us to edit and to plan our presentation if you want to change anything directly you can change right here so it is very easy for us to edit so the so first option a normal view so you can able to see is so outline view where you can able to edit very easily and next comes your slide tab view the slides 
in your presentation as thumbnail size image where you edit the thumbnail makes it easy for you to navigate through your presentation and to see the effects of any design changes you can also easily rearrange add or delete slides right here in case of slide so where we can able to see the thumbnail image of a slide so where we can able to see the thumbnail image and it is very easy to navigate between the slides see it's how easy to navigate between the slides it's very faster and slide plan in the upper right section of the powerpoint window the slide plan display a large view of current slide with the current slide shows in this view you can add text and insert pictures tables smart art graphics charts drawing objects text boxes and movies sounds hyperlink and animations so this area is called a slide pan where we can able to insert headings images clip arts drawings videos audios anything as we like we can able to customize it so this is called as slide pan so this is called as slide pan where we can able to see the large view of a slide where we can able to edit everything starting from text audio video everything as as we like we can able to edit it and last is a note pan in the note pan below this slide pan you can type notes that applies to the current slide later you can print your notes in refer to them when you give your presentation you can also print notes to give your audience or include the notes and presentation that you send to audience or post on a web page you can search between the slide and outline tab so here you can able to see note pan see this is called as note pan where i can able to give some notes to see see fisherman flying institute salala omen and this is nothing but the note view where we can able to save the notes and slide sort of view the slide sort of view gives you a view of your slides in thumbnail form this view make it easy for you to sort and organize the sequence of your slide as you create your presentation and then also you prepare your presentation for printing you can add sections in slide sort of view as well as in sort and sort slide into different categories of sections so here you can able to see slide sort of view so it's very easy to rearrange the slides as we like and we can able to make a uh, sections so that we can able to categorize it so this is called as slide sort of view and note page view the note page pan is located under the slide pan you can type the note that applied to the current slide later you can print your notes and refer to them when you gives your presentation it's already we have seen this see note pan is located below right here where we can able to write our notes and give it at the time of presentation or at time of printing and master view master view includes slide and sort and notes view there are three main slides that store information about the presentation including background colors fonts effects and placeholders size and position the key benefit to working in a slide view is that on the slide master note master or and sort master you can make universal style changes to every slide note pages or and sort associated with your presentation so here comes your master slide 
so where we can able to customize our slide or presentation as we like from starting from back background color font and everything even theme everything can be customized using the slide master and answer so where we can able to see header footers every details all the things comes in your and sort master and notes master so where we can able to insert your notes and notes will be displayed along with your slides in case of note master so these are the three views in master view one is a slide master and sort master and note master so view for delivering your presentation use slideshow view to deliver your presentation to your audience slideshow view occupies the full computer screen exactly the way you present will look on a big screen when your audience see it you can see how your graphics timing movies animated effects and transition effects will look during the actual presentation to access slideshow press escape so here we'll be having slideshow where we can able to start from the beginning or from the current slide so or else here is the slideshow view so this or the places where we can able to use first is uh, from beginning right so it will start from the first slide onwards or current stage for example in 26 slide let us say now I am in current slide 10 10 is my current slide if I click right here it will start from this 10th slide onwards or I'll simply use this which will start from the first slide and if you want to come out of from this use escape and we use for delivering your presentation presentation view is a key slideshow based view that you can use while delivering your presentation by using two monitors you can run other programs and view speaker notes that your audience cannot see to use presentation view presenter view make sure that your computer has multiple monitor capable capabilities turn on multiple monitor support and turn on presenter view for more information about using presenter view while viewing your speaker notes privately while delivering a presentation on multiple monitors so here is a presentation view in which will support on multiple monitors where we can able to use LCD to present our presentation on a large view as well as we can able to monitor the same using a desktop or a laptop use reading view to deliver your presentation not to audience but instead to someone viewing your presentation on your own computer or use reading view on your own computer when you want to view a presentation not in full screen slideshow view but in a window with simple controls that makes the presentation easy to review you can also switch from reading view to one of the other view if you want to change the presentation so here is called as a reading view when you click this view it comes in a simpler way it's not uh, just like a huge way so I will show you so I'm going to press escape and now I'm going to use the reading view see it's not on the full screen but it is simple with simple tools so again I'm going for slideshow from the current slide and use for delivering your presentation use for preparing and printing your presentation to help you to save paper and ink you want to prepare your print job before you print powerpoint provides views and settings helps you to specify what you want to print slides and answers or notes or page and how you want this those jobs to print in color gray grayscale black blue white with frames and more and print preview in print preview lets you to specify settings for 
what you want to print hands out notes pages and outline or slides and when you change the default view to one of one that makes sense for your work powerpoint will always open in that view among the views that are available to set as a default or slide sorter view outline only view and notes view and variation or normal view by default powerpoint opens in normal view and displaying the thumbnail notes and slide view if you want if you prefer however you can specify the powerpoint open in a different view such as a slide sorter view and slide show view and note page view and variation or normal view i will show this before this and to print to make your print view go to file tab click options and in powerpoint options and click advance and under display open all document using this view let's select the view that you want to set as the default and then click ok so now i will tell you how to do this first we'll see the printing so go to file it is a print option where we can able to see the number of copies and here you want to select the printer and that in so print all side all slides or print current slides or custom range if you want to make it customize yes you are allowed to make it customize from slide number let us say 2 comma 5 comma 8 comma 9 so this page numbers will be printed and say it's a full page slides or note page or outline page or slide 1 slide 2 slide 3 9 so based on this if, if I need note page so it will print only the note page and here you can able to see this is called as a print preview where we can able to zoom it minimize it or maximize it based on our requirement and in file tab where you can able to see an option for example if you want to change the view at the time of opening so go to uh, file tab and here is the option go to option and again go to advance and here comes your display here is the option open all document using this view here you can able to change normal outline or normal thumbnail normal outline slide and normal thumbnail and slide normal notes and slides normal slide only outline only slide sorter and notes if you want you can able to choose any of this and press ok to make it effect so once again i will review so there are different kinds of views the views are available in two areas one is in view tab it's a normal slide sorter note page and uh, reading view uh, slide master master and sort and note master in simply we used to say presentation views and master views and at the bottom of the page we can able to see the view shortcuts so this is a normal slide sorter reading view and slideshow view and apart from that we'll be having slides and outline so now it is a normal view so now it's a normal view so slide sorter view where we can able to navigate very easily it's a note page view where we can able to see our notes and reading view so it's not a full screen it's a partial full screen so use escape to come out of this and slide masters so where we can able to customize our themes background and font color and and sorts this also a kind of view where we can able to use it and node masters where we can able to see the node masters along with the header and footer so these are the various views options available in microsoft 2010 i'm sure that you may enjoy this video thanks for watching this video thank you